بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم مائی نیم از سلمان اینڈ یو آر واچنگ دی کانس اکیڈمی بائی دی آسٹیٹیوشن سو ان دس ویڈیو وی آر گوئنگ ٹو کنٹینرائز آ ریئیکٹ ایپلیکیشن بائی یوزنگ ٹاکر سو لیٹس جس اسٹارٹ فرام دا اسکریچ ویل ڈو دس آئی ول کریٹ آ فولڈر اینڈ آئی آلریڈی ہیو اے فولڈر دیٹ نیم از docker and i'll be creating a new project for the react application so let's just click on the new folder react docker and let's just name it and go to the command prompt and create dash react dash app and the name of my app should be like a uh, docker react okay now let's wait for a while till then it creates a react application by using this boilerplate command okay my react application is ready now so let's just check it by opening that command prompt writing code dot to open the react app in the visual studio code okay now let's just check it first whether it is working properly or not then we'll be containerizing this npm start open the package.json mm, react script version is 4.0.3 okay now let's just wait starting the development server yeah it is it is working let's just change something in the source app.js instead of this use h1 hello docker with react and let's make it safe and check it oh fine it's, it's uh, all all clear now it's time to containerize this let's just close it and uh, okay in the root directory react uh, docker this is the root directory i am going to add a file new file that uh, will be dot docker ignore and i'll be creating another file in the root directory docker file Uh, make sure the D should be capital and F is small and this is the naming convention for this one. So I have created two files docker file and the docker.ignore and I'll be pasting few commands in the docker file. I already have this so don't you get worry about the commands I'll be uh, giving you in the description and later in the upcoming video I'll be making the video on these commands that uh, which command is used for it, what purpose so right now i'm just copying this for the short video and pasting it in the docker file and make sure your script version should be matching with your package.json script if it is something else you just come over here and paste and everything will be fine okay Uh, let's just save it and in the docker dot air dot docker ignore file open with this mm, copy this and let's make it safe all right it's time to down this uh, application from localhost 300 it is still running i guess fine 
let's just close this now check still running npm okay, this is the node and kill the process mm, let's refresh this all right we have down in this site from the local host port 300 now it's time to containerize this it's time to run this application into a container first i'll open the docker container you can see there is no image that is related to my react application this is another image react dash app but i'll be creating another uh, uh, image for the react app so come to the terminal and i'll have to write a command okay. docker build minus t and my image name will be docker react image colon def is the label let's just run it uh, docker build required exactly one argument sorry i make a mistake in the command after the label uh, they uh, put some space and write a dot and let's just enter the command as you can see it is creating the image okay there is a problem with the image no docker file no such file or directory let's just check where i have created the mm. oops i made a mistake as you can see my docker file is in the source folder that is why it was saying that there is no docker file make it in the root folder i added in the wrong now it's not in the source folder new terminal and docker build minus t react docker app def space dot now it's fine the command is correct there is no mistake uh, it has found the, the docker file and created an image successfully now it's, let's just check on the docker desktop as you can see my image has been created okay and there is no container running against this image so i'll be the next step is i'm going to create that container or for this or from this image so the command is uh, this docker run minus dash it dash p 300 300 this is the i'm defining the port that i'm i want to run it on a port 300 and my container name is this react docker app with the label i'm called yes you may find all these command in the description don't have to get worried and i'm going to paste it over here sorry only the command is not copied completely Control C, Control V. Mm -hmm. It's executing this command right now. Okay, React script start, and it's taking a little bit time, few seconds only. Starting the development server. okay here we are so we are done with this it's saying that uh, you may find your site on this link and when i click this on the local host colon 300 and let's just check the container first as you can see there is a container running from this image react docker app colon dash and it's running on the port 300 you may open this from also here open in the browser 
as you can see the uh, react application is running in the docker container so we have successfully uh, completed that so that's all for this video and if you like my video and it help you to create a react application in the container docker container so please like share and subscribe to my channel till then see you in the next video love is